It matters how well you can perform here in a real world situation. Now, this tells you that fitness is the physical competence and actually even the mental competence. But it's the physical competence in responding to contextual demands placed upon you. So you may think, so what are you talking about? Yeah, contextual demands, what are those demands? Well, that's what we've seen before with those photos. The environment where you find yourself and then the situation where you find yourself. And the combination of both is going to dictate how you should move. Now usually one way to address that is to think in terms of GPP, general physical preparedness. So we're going to arrange a program based on a selection of drills that are usually functional drills. It means they're supposed to transfer to something useful to life. And that works. That does work. It does work to some extent, but we're going to see that actually it's a suboptimal way to approach physical preparedness for real life, real world applications. This is functional, but is it practical? This is good for core strength. It's a bit weird, but it's good for core strength. And, but is this practical? So what do you mean by practical? I mean that, for instance, the pull-up is a functional upper body strength conditioning drill, right? It's good for conditioning. But in a move nat, if you think move, moving naturally, then you think, well, no, this is actually a practical climbing skills. You're climbing. When you do pull up, you're climbing. And that, that makes a huge difference. It does make a huge difference because if you think this way, if you think not just functional, general, physical preparedness, but if you think practical movement, then you're going to start thinking of all the other ways you could climb on top of that bar or across that bar. And you're going to start thinking about movement skills and you're going to start thinking of the specific conditioning that you need in order to be able to move in different ways than just pulling your body up. It means that physical competence it's not a, only a matter of being fit or unfit, but being inept or adept in terms of movement. Can you move well? So both sides of the cone are quite important. It's not either or.